Hello for the YouTubes. It's me again. More Dark Souls 3. Um, I thought about it. So, basically, I didn't do much in this game by now. I fought a few bosses. In fact, all the necessary ones. Maybe one optional boss, like the tree, dude. Tree, dude. And that's it, I guess. That's it. I didn't do more or any optional stuff, I guess, because I didn't stumble upon optional stuff. I was like going forward, right? So, and therefore, I guess my um, my my I'm not I'm not experienced in fighting that much. I was chime. Good. I'm not experienced in fighting that much, right? They see they're out for revenge, dude. No. Go get these sparklies. The twinkling, the twinkling sparklies that I missed. Like around. Yeah, somewhere. Oh, there, there should be a weapon down here. I, I looked it up actually. There is another. There is another weapon, right around. Ah, thank you. Right around there. This should be a weapon. I guess. <laughs> Next time I play this, I will count my death. For sure, I will count how many times I died. But not now. But not for now. Let's go one bonfire back, I guess, to get this 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 weapon. Maybe it's good. I don't know. I want these twinkling night night charts, maybe or twinkly sparkly. I don't know what this is. Hey Odin, nice to see you too. I don't know what it is. I, I want I want it. I missed it I guess. So and then I will do a little bit of warm up against, I don't know, normal mobs, I guess. Does the number of deaths affect anything? Um, yes and no. If you're not going for it, then no. Oh, I'm dead bone uh, But if you're going for, like, um, a specific ending, then yes. So. You can get free level ups. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is bad. Bad, 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 bad. You can get free level ups from uh, dying. Um, but if you do, oh yeah, there are two twinkling type nights, nice. But if you do that, then you will like go hollow. Hollow is like, um, I don't know what hollow is ex exactly. It's like in Dark Souls One, you get hollowed. So, or or you are a hollow. Um, not you. You 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 are you're not a hollow. You're um just a dude. Uh, under dude, but if you are a hollow, the way I uh, remember this, it's like you are like an undead dude that is like that has no soul and is evil, like an evil undead, sort of. I don't know. I, I guess. Oh, I, I can't, I can't, I can't. I can't do weapon anymore? Huh. Bad. Where's my weapon, in fact? Where is my weapon? 
It's my weapon. You see my weapon? I don't see my weapon. Am I blind? Oh, it's not in here anymore, right? Because I leveled it too much. Okay. So there is this dude. I can show you the dude. I, I, the, one of the uh, not so many dudes I uh, get. This, this dude. Oh, he d he died. Why? Why did he die, guys? Uh, so I rescued this dude. And hmm. And if <laughs> and you can go to him. Hmm. And he's dead now. But you can go to him and you get free level ups, but your hollowing, hollow stat will increase and basically you're evil then and you can get an evil ending or the evil ending. I don't know. You bet he's dead, so can 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 go for an evil ending, I guess. For 20k souls, nice dude. Oh, okay. Let's buy this tower key and get, let's go up this tower. This is another thing that I can do. Do that. We can go in the sewers too. Ooh, this upward slash slash. Oh, cool. Normal one? This one? Get, get five free levels from him? Yeah, but you are like super undead then, right? You are super hollow. If you do that. <coughs> you can. I don't know, you can, you can marry a girl, I, I mean, marry is maybe the false, you know, term to use, but you can do something. Yeah, you gain hollowing. It a fire keeper's soul. Again, first playthrough, not entirely blind. Oh my god, can I do the jump? Oh my god, I would die, right? Try jumping, yeah. Oh. Did I just go for this? It, it seems so far down. Huh. Right, I guess. Oh. Oh, didn't jump. Okay. Why I keep a robe? Oh! Oh, 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 this is bad and bad. Is this like a firekeeper's grave? Are these all firekeepers? Esther's ring, what is this? Okay. Firekeeper's ring. Increased HP with talk with Estus flasks. Oh, okay, so it's an <laughs> nice jump. I was, I just fall. I was just fallen to the ground. There was not, there was not much of a jump going on. I guess it was, it was like a, like this, like a, like a, given up. <laughs> Where's the firekeeper at? Oh, ah, there we are. Welcome, Huss. Ashen one, this is much like what lies within me. Then let it find its own place within my bosom. Okay. She will understand. Now healing dark sigil. You have no dark sigil. Good. Farewell, Ashen one. I did that. Can go for um 
a few other things if we really want to. But I don't know. Let's travel back and try. <coughs> Sorry. And try the boss first. So, you know. Maybe I can get him. I would love to finish the game today, the, the main game. So, like, two bosses, this one and the last one, maybe. Should be. Around this many bosses to finish the game, and then... Ah, uh, I... You know, if you don't... If you're not in my Discord, I told people about... Uh, I'm not everyone, sorry. I, 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 I share stuff so loosely, so... Sometimes I do it in only only for these guys, only for that guys, I don't know why. Um, I, I tested the Moguri mod uh, today for Final Fantasy IX starting tomorrow. And the Moguri mod is like, uh, it, it, it uses the Final Fantasy IX rema a remake or a port for Steam. And uses that to make it a real like HD game it looks so freaking good Yo. If you didn't, if you know about the Steam version, I can't talk now after the after I died. If you know the Steam version of Final Fantasy IX, it's okay, but it's only um, you know people or the company is like, yeah, this is a remake, this is or, or this is a port something. You can play it on PC now, but we put almost no effort into it, so you know. Um, it has the four. Uh, it has no widescreen resolution. <laughs> Why? Why would it? And the menuing is like the the menuing from the from the port. There is a port for Final Fantasy IX for I don't know what kind of console or, or mobile or whatever. And it's very. Uh, you have to get used to it. It's not bad, but it's different. Let's 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 call it a different. And um, yeah, it's it it is okay. But now that I saw the Moguri mod thing, like what they did, wow! It's so it's it's impressive what people can do. Did you uh, hear about or did you read about? There is a team, or there was a team, that um, implemented um, like Oblivion into Skyrim. It's so freaking cool. Oh my god. Okay, I have to relearn this boss now because yesterday I failed to kill him, so I'm, today I'm like cold, so I have to relearn him. Sorry about that, but I'm like feeling I I'm feeling like rusty. Scalivian, yeah, it's so cool, like People are like if people are passionate about uh, certain things, they can go, they can push mountains, right? Damn. It's like so good. Or move mountains, I don't know how to say this in English. But, but yes, I want to say that, right that. It's so cool. Freaking passionate people that are doing everything for their passion. So cool. I would, I would, I would, I uh, would like to have a passion. <laughs> so that I can go all into that. But, you know, the thing with streaming is you can, you can, uh, no, on play video games, you, you just can't go all in on this. It's like, you, 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 you look like a freak if you do. So. This is the only Elder Scroll game you haven't beaten? Uh. Freaking. Sneaky! 
devil, dude. Sneaky devil. Did you see that? Did you did you not see him? I, I didn't hear I, I did I did not hear him. Maybe I should damn crank up my volume. I couldn't hear him port. I, I was like, is he doing this fancy like sword beam attack? But who who where is he? Yeah, models are the true heroes. Yeah, but I'm it's it's so weird, right? I personally now the Moguri mod is a you know it's an ex exception, but it it doesn't changes the base game. It it only makes the game look nice, I guess. Um, I don't know mods for me personally. I'm not I'm not I'm not I don't know. I don't enjoy mods that much. Uh, because I feel like if I install a mod, um, I. I don't know if I if I have to use a mod to make a game better for me or playable and I didn't enjoy the vanilla game I don't know I'm not sure if a mod is the right thing to do then do it slow what was this double port dude much chunk him dude Th that, is, that is true that is true bug fixes yeah bug fixes are fine and uh, I, I, you know, I like the idea. <laughs> he, he like hit me spot on, dude. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> Plunged me spot on with the sword. Damn. How could... This happened. I don't know. Yeah, this th this is true too. I I mean, like, it's weird, right? Nowadays, it's like, yeah, you know, uh, Among Us. Among Us is a game that is exploding right now on you know various uh, gaming platforms, and the um, the the game itself is nothing new because you know trouble in terrorist town was the in this exact same game basically and um i don't know i feel like if you want success these days you have to use <clears throat> something that is good and make it the same thing and call it different i, I don't know Let's try to get to phase two and don't die. I hate him. Oh, I hate him. Barely made it. I stand, dude. It's too initiated. Initiated.
Ooh, so he 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 does more damage. He does more damage in phase two. Okay. His brother is so heavy. His weight on his on his down slam is harder now. I I did I did not I I, I wanted to heal and I was like. I was like, yeah, I heal now and I get squatted. Use the swap weapon technique? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, maybe I should use the swap weapon technique. But I, you know, the, the game is fast, so I'm not sure if I can. Do I have this sword now? Why? Why are you using the hollow thing? Let's, let's change that. It's not a bad weapon, but I'm not used to it that much. Go for this again. The swap weapon technique. I don't, I'm not sure. Maybe, maybe it will. Maybe it will help. No, I, I, I can't decide which weapon I, I like more. But swords, swords are my. I looked at all the weapons you can get in um, this game, like daggers and axes, hammers, maces, um, whips, fist weapons, uh, scythe. All, all, all this freaking freaky stuff, but I I don't know if I if I look at them I I, I think to myself like yep yeah, swords. Nah, he he, I was I was too afraid. I was too afraid because I, because I didn't I didn't saw him early enough. Damn it, I. <clears throat> I want this fight to end, basically. I want this fight to end. It's uh, it's the hardest fight. It's it's not the fight that you know gets to me the most. I guess I guess the mo the fight that gets gets that was like um, bugging me the most was like the 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 thing the the dragon armor maybe or the um. Uh, not Pontiff, not Dancer, not Yorm. I can, you know. There was a boss. I, I didn't, I didn't enjoy that much. But, but Dragon, Bra Dragon Slayer armor was like top, top tier annoying, top tier annoying battle so far. Maybe I will rate the bosses of Dark Souls three someday if I do them. More. But this boss is like the the thing about this boss, he's not a hard boss. Or not a not a fast boss. Ah, my nose is itching. Itchy no se. There is the frostbine. Of switch weapons. Oh, this was good. Abyss Watchers, no, Abyss Watchers was super easy. I, di I killed them like in four, in four tries. Super easy boss. I know how to cheese them, so even in my first playthrough, I knew, I knew what attack to bait in the second phase. So second phase was easy as, like, I hit second phase two times. The second phase, uh, the second time I, I hit him, he, he fall. So Abyss Watchers was easy. And I had a comment on YouTube. Uh, today actually and it said yeah dude like wow abyss watchers was my total it was a nightmare i i'm like no the dlc bosses yeah i'm looking forward to do a playthrough with dlc bosses and then it's like i will do like um new game again 
Because I, I'm not sure if New Game Plus is giving you anything new. Besides of, mm, the bosses have more health. Yeah, more health is nice. I, I like I like when my challenge is in, you know, they have more health and they hit harder. Yeah, cool. It's like super, super challenge. Yes, good. I like that. <laughs> no use. Smash. Smash. The, the, the beginning of the fight is so dumb. The beginning of this fight is so dumb. I wish I wish the beginning of this fight would be more consistent. The beginning is so freaking dumb. It's so freaking dumb. Like yep, yeah, you come into the the fucking arena. He's porting. He do he can do two kinds of attacks. If it hits you, you die. Good. You can get better rings in new game plus. Yeah, but see. Sure, you get better stuff because things get harder, right? But you only need these kind of things because things are harder. So I, I'm not sure if... Uh, but not harder. They hit harder and they have more HP, right? They have no different uh, or alternate um, boss um, movements. They have, they have not moves. They have no new moves in New Game Plus. It's just more health. Right? Slavnet Gale? Yeah, I read about him. I didn't see the fight against Gale that often. Oh, there. Oh, wrong weapon, by the way. Yeah. Oh, I didn't realize that this is this that this can happen again. Oh my god, this is so bad. This fight is just annoying. The second phase is the first phase again. There is nothing different in his movement. The only thing is he has a magic user on his back, and he will survive him, right? Like I have to kill the backpack to finish the fight, right? So I, I I basically fight like ten times against the 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 bigger dude, right? What do you guys think? Is this the free to fight is a good fight? It's a three phase boss fight, right? It's like against her, against her and her and Daddy Coon, and then in, when Daddy Coon dies, she revives again, and she has like two two blades. Or is it like against him, against him and her? I don't know. Oh my god! Okay. 
survived it. Somehow. Oh, do the same move, damn, three times in a row, dude. Like, no, no biggie. I, I can't handle that. That's totally fine. I can't. Pfft. Fuck you, dude. I, I'm getting angry. This is not good. I'm like 30 minutes in and I'm, I'm like getting angry because this fight is just... This fight is dumb. Sorry. It was just her, then her and daddy, and then her again. Yeah, okay. Cool. This fight is dumb, dude. I hate this fight. I, I, I'm, I'm, you know, I'm like on my way to hating this fight because if you're not like on point with everything you do, he will just crush you every freaking time. I know it's in every every boss in Dark Souls, but this fight is like. The setup to get to the second phase is too long. This is what this is what pissed me off. Like to get into second phase, it's too long. It's way too long. I know that he will revive this dude again and again in phase two. Yeah, Waited too long. Waited way too long. I call this one bullshit. I call this one bullshit. Getting into second phase and first phase hit kills me. Okay, good. Good. I saw this. I saw that. You saw that too. Don't deny it. This was bullshit on another level, dude. Oh my god, I hate this fight so much. I can't. I will. I, I, I don't. Ah, damn it. I don't. <clears throat> I'm so close to, to say, nah, fuck Dark Souls 3. I'm so close to, to say fuck Dark Souls 3. Everything up to this point was fun and challenging and good and a scale and, you know, it getting harder every time. This boss fight is like, nope, 